All right, YouTube, so this vlog is very similar to the previous Inktober entries, except this will be more like a sketchbook tour, a more formal one. So let's dive into it with the first drone. We have Samurai Jones Beach, which is inspired by a vacation I desire to go on that I will not be explaining too much about because the vlog for another day. But as you can see, I have the sword, the samurai hat, and the cool tattoos I have in person. And next up, we have Alexander Aurelius himself, the great music artist that I'm great friends with and love all his stuff. As you can see, he's got a microphone, a sick trench coat, and a sick chain as well, along with these sick glasses. I know I say sick quite a lot in this drawing. Next up, we have Mr. Septile as an MMA fighter. As you can see, he's got the Septile tattoo. He's sort of like human Septile, but not really. But he does have a brother who is also a successful fighter. And this is Gengar in the minimalist style. Here we have David Goggins, one of my favorite YouTubers himself. As you can see, he's caught in a windy storm, but he doesn't care. Here we have the drawing of Linkin Park and Katy Perry crossover. It's Chester Bennington himself and Katy Perry, who are probably my two favorite music artists, to be honest. We have the albino pumpkin with blood coming out of its eyes and the bat on its shoulder, as well as cobweb driven down from him and a skull arm. Can't go wrong with that Halloween aesthetic. And yesterday for Inktober, the theme was snacks, so I drew one of my favorite snacks, pizza snack. Or just pizza in general, not pizza snack, but came up with an even better drawing for the snack prompt, and it was myself eating pizza with a cake. Sorry, I lost my train of thought. A cake hat, because I love birthday cake too. And that's all for today. So yeah, this was the short sketchbook tour, Inktober, whatever the hell you want to call it. I do have another few cool vlogs planned that will be movie related and probably art related, but until then, thank you all for watching. Stay tuned for more soon. Inktober has been one of the few good things about 2024. Goodbye.